Hello darlings and welcome to Myra Beauty. Today we are doing a hot chocolate candle. So we're going to start off um, putting our, what do you call it? Our, uh, yeah, the wick. The wick inside our candle jar. I'm using a mug to resemble like hot chocolate, you know, drink out of mug, but whatever. Make sure you get your glue gun and put it on the bottom and take a stick and push it down or whatever to push it down. Make sure it sticks at the bottom. And you're gonna need that to hold in place. So need to take that stick plus another stick and just hold that so it doesn't move. Yep, yep, like that. Next, we are going to melt two cups of the, um, or it's one and three fourths cup of soy wax. And I have some brown coloring for the main base of the hot chocolate. I had to make my own brown coloring because I, I, I don't know why I haven't bought any brown coloring. But anyway, um, I transferred it to a measuring cup so it could. Uh, pour more easily look at me making a mess almost messed up my wick there anyway I poured that up and I left space on purpose like I said it was a cup and three-fourths so I gotta hold that in place again with my sticks you'll see why in a minute and I forgot to show y'all the hot chocolate fragrance so that was the hot chocolate fragrance anyway we're gonna do our marshmallows so I'm just gonna take some plain soy wax and I have this marsh cute little marshmallow um, silicone mold that I got off Amazon and we have some marshmallow fragrance and I'm just gonna put that in there so no coloring for this because you know marshmallows are white for the most part anyway fill those up I should have had like two or three molds you guys because I did this like three or four times because I need a lot of marshmallows anyway um, the candles not all the way set up so I'm able to push these marshmallows in so they'll stay and I took a lighter so I can make a double layer so those other marshmallows will melt. It melt so those will stay on top. Next we're gonna do candy cane. So I'm doing a layer of white soy wax and red. So we're just gonna do like a little single layer of white with the candy cane fragrance and then we're gonna take that same mixture and just add some red food coloring, not food coloring, candle coloring. And we're gonna put that on top of our white layer once that has set up. And you'll see why I did that in a minute. Um, so see, it looks like double layer, like kind of like a candy cane. And I'm just gonna chop that up into pieces. So like resembles like little candy cane pieces. It was giving me a hard time, you guys. Anyway. All right, next we're gonna make some dark chocolate sauce drizzle on top. I'm actually using black um, candle coloring. It's like that. I wanted to be just like a dark chocolate sauce. It was actually a little bit too dark, but it is what it is, but yep. That's our dark chocolate drizzle on top. And then I take the candy cane pieces and I just stick it to that mixture before it hardens up. And yep, that's basically it for your hot chocolate candle. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Love you. Mwah.